to the tackle of Great Lens, especially with Bianca. I think it boosts up her confidence after that. You can see that she's happy, she's confident. But Altea has a really good role this year, especially from last year, Olympic Games and European champion, Grand Prix medalist. This yes, will be a tough fight. Yeah, I was commentating on in the European Championships the and she red. was just Rock. from the start yeah, looking is. incredible. But Rendell today has just had an incredible day, hasn't she? Such, I suppose, maybe even a bit of a surprise for her to be here, but her confidence has grown and grown. So I think we're in for a really exciting final. Oh, I agree totally with you. Altea is, you, uh, people think that she's, you know, calm fighter, but she likes to fight. She's not afraid of clinch fight. She's tall, she's strong, her legs are super long, and yep. when you're, you're dealing with a tall fighter who's not afraid of closed fight, it can be tough. Definitely, and here we go. We're waiting for the referee to start the match. Referee may start the contest. Just checking the gum shield, and we will check the body arm and the head guard. I'm sure you're always tempted to hit that a little bit harder than you no, should. No, never. I don't like that style, <laughs> honestly. I know you, Jeff. <laughs> Sometimes you see that happening and it's, yes. yeah, it's too much, isn't it? It's not it professional. It pisses you off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to, when you go to, to the fight, it's something different in your head. Now, here we go. Both athletes ready for this final, I'm sure. And Loren using those headshots. Using that back leg again, which is nice to see. But as we can see, both fighters are aggressive, especially France in the beginning. I think she wants to make a strong start. Definitely, but for me, Brandel, the confidence for her to yes. not let, to not move back. She's, she's in that middle distance. She's trying to control the ring. And it's really nice to see that confidence grown from today. Yes, strength I to agree. strength. I think we can see here that uh, Lorena is stronger now. This is the difference. Lorena is plus 73, Altea is minus 73. So we can see the you know, weight difference. Yeah, you can see that strength. Brendel today has been really strong. Her kicks, are, it's almost like she's not got the, a lot, massive amount of speed, but yes. the strength and the power in her and precision in her kicks has been really great to see. But we have one point on the board for Brendel. One Gam Jung could make all the difference. As we saw in the male heavyweight semi-final, 1-0, finish the round, and that's it. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Oh, nice strong back leg from Lorin. Not quite there with, there with that punch from Brendel, but she might get there in the end. That was a solid punch, but obviously not strong enough to score. Probably, for me, not enough commitment, yes. nearly. Yeah. I like the fakes from Lorraine. I think, for me, I'd like to see a little bit more. I think she has that extra skill over Brendel with that movement and the faking. Yes, she has, but it's hard for heavyweights. I know, obviously, especially in clinch fight now, when you do a lot of movements, you're tired <laughs> and you need more energy. <laughs> Not much happening in the short distance, Melitza, with these two. Yes. I think, for me, as you said, it can probably be quite tiring in that short distance. Always try and make action, always trying to make space. Especially when you deal with the heavyweight, it is different. Yeah. France is trying with the back leg turning kick, but all the time in the blocks, Lorraine is blocking really good, and first round is for her. I didn't expect, like, this kind of round because last time they, they competed, it was European qualification and France won with big difference. But wow. you can see everything can change, obviously. This is a good start for, for Earl Loren, obviously. I think the more you're in those positions, those finals, semi finals, in those major competitions, the more you learn, the more your confidence grows. And Brendel's confidence, even just from like the first match, quarter final, semi final, it's like as if, ah, I do belong here. Yes. And that's it's dangerous, isn't it, when you're the champion and you've got to deal with that. I mean, you've been there many times, people trying to take your spot, yes. take your glory. In but that's an important hard. attitude. As you said, you know, when you grow during the day, if you, you know, if you win silver, you go home satisfied with your performance. And that's what's most important. I don't like I want silver, I want bronze. When you're satisfied with yourself, with how you did it in the fight, I go home happy all the time because I know I, I have something to work on. 
and I have my medal in my pocket, have points. Exactly. So. And we learn and we grow, and it's yes. about peaking at the right times, as we've have, spoken yes, about all absolutely. weekend. Here we go into round two. Great start from Lorin. Again, not much action in that middle distance. Both, both thinking, you know what, it's too much hard work in that middle <laughs> distance, let's just... But it's hard for a long-legged uh, person to just kick and clinch yeah. fight. But They're nice still trying, yes. Yeah, Brandel's trying there. I think something, if one of them makes a bit more of an action in the middle distance, it could make a difference for this second round. That was nice. Chop kick from fans for 3-1, and we have obviously one more, one minute, 30 seconds more, but this is now 3-0. Yeah, it gives Lauren that bit of confidence now, doesn't it? Yes. In the second round. A nice little front leg attempt there from Lauren. Usually the she scores like that, especially when, when shorter girls want to punch. She goes back, front leg. Yeah, I like this. The, yes. Tables have turned a little bit in this second round. One minute to go, 3-0, Lauren. Looking a little bit more confident. Brandel now having to try and do a little bit more to try and chase. How does she look now, Melissa? I think she's a little bit... A little bit tired for yeah. me. She uh, she wanted to push her out like 10 seconds ago, but I think now she's tired. Not the same energy as the first round. Yeah, it's not going her way now as much as the first round, so you can see a little bit more... I suppose panic, like, what can I yes. do now? But, I mean, that's normal. But France is always constant. You can see she can fight for six minutes. We saw her a couple times do that, but she's still attacking, punching, doing her thing, and 6-0, front leg to the head. We can see now Lorena is a little bit, you know, confused maybe what to do, but you have to drown and maybe not to lose your energy in this 20 seconds, but it's not impossible, but it's hard to be from 6-0 to 6-6. In 20 seconds to go, is it, is, it worth, is it worth it when there's such a gap? For me, no. Mm. Honestly, no, because you didn't score for almost two minutes. Well, great shots again from friends, but now just wait your time, take your energy, you know, take a break, breathe and go to the third round. She got two points there on the board. Five seconds to go. As you said, Melissa, possibly too, too much of a gap to claw this back for the second yes. round. Yes. They have time now to take a breath, yes. take a step back. And I mean, you can see a little bit on this one, I think, for me, Lauren, that the experience. Yes. She, she's really experienced, really young. I, I love her style because, because she's so calm, but always, you know, composed, focused, knows what to do, listen to her coach, and I think that's really important in these kind of moments. This is the best of the best, you know, semi-final, final. If you lose it in, in, in one game, you're going down, but she's not, she's not looking like that. Altea, after first round, she lost, then second round, even better, now third round. For me, she doesn't look tired, tired, no. But now it's on Lorena just to maybe put some more aggression, especially in the first minute, maybe. Yeah, I think for me, exactly the same. Now it's your time to go, listen, yes. this is where I belong. This is my yes. ring. I am the experienced one. I think sometimes you have to do that when you don't yeah, want to I let the, the younger ones have too much confidence <laughs> yes. coming in. I know, sometimes it's hard, but <laughs> I wish that counts. Yeah. Here we go, third and final round, the women's final. Great start from Brandon with a little bit more aggression as well, a yes, bit more yes. commitment. I love the strain, I love the, the push kick, but sometimes it's awful when you don't score <laughs> and you put all your energy. Looks great, sounds yes. great, no point. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, nice attempted yes. headshot from Brandil. It's really nice back kick, then front kick, front kick after that the head. We can see that Altea has more power in her right now. I think she has more of that X factor. Yes. You know, yes. that front leg with that right leg. It, she can score from like any yes. distance. It's, yeah. it's dangerous. Yeah. But sometimes she, uh, she does too, and you, you yeah. don't expect that. Yeah, she has the X factor, she has the experience, but again, still all to play for in this last round. And Randella's come out looking really strong. 
Yes, especially she... that <laughs> pushing clinch fight. Good back kick, really. She tried once and it scored. The first one you could see not a lot of commitment. The yes. second one, okay, let's go again. It's okay to try the same kick twice. Of course. Oh, this is hard to call, isn't it, Milica? Such a great final round for the women's final. I think now Altea is going all or nothing. We'll see for 43 seconds. She has time, not to rush, yeah. but Lorraine is good with blocks. She's maybe a little bit tired now, but if you have good blocks, good clash, you can do it. Uh, good shot. Was one of those, looks good, sounds good, <laughs> yeah. no point. Block. But again, with these athletes are used to that now. It's fair. It is what it is. Yes. Oh, an amazing wow. hook kick from Brendel. Wow. She's happy. She's happy. You can see 24 more seconds, and she's satisfied with her result currently. Just over 20 seconds to go, and a smile as well from Brendel after that headshot. What a win this would be if she can take this. Yes. it's easy for her we can see oh, but France is not giving up five to two and seven more seconds this is not a time to survive for Brandel yeah. one headshot from Loren could come from anywhere anytime I'm gonna hold on to that lead you can't survive and wow. there we go the champion amazing absolutely amazing all day from Lorena Brandel gold medal big smile she has had an Absolutely yes. amazing day today. Incredible day for her. First medal, gold medal. She is happy. Well deserved, really well deserved gold medal. Really tough matches today.